Alrighty, for one, my name is Mikhail99, and welcome back to Amori. Uh, last session, we pretty much went ahead and continued our journey through Sweetheart's Castle. Uh, we defeated uh, the lineage of Sir Maximus, which was pretty interesting. And then we made it to the courtyard, which was where we kind of learned um, that Kel could um, aim with his um, tag ability, so we, that was pretty cool. Um, in this session, we will be going ahead and continuing on through our journey into the courtyard. I'm going to be going and seeing what we can do with that statue of Sweetheart. Um, there's like a password system for that, so we'll pretty much have to learn what we need to do with that, and then we'll see how, if we'll be able to get outside, out away from uh, Sweetheart's castle. So, um, anyways, hope you guys will enjoy it. If you missed the previous episodes of Done for the series, you can check it out on my playlist, my YouTube channel. If you haven't already, I consider consider subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any other games we're playing at the moment. Alright, so, first off, wait, what was that? Hang on a minute. <laughs> I noticed something. Oh wait, that's the watermelon. I thought that was some, like, random item. Dun, 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 dun. I did notice that there was these soldiers around here, so I think we might have to talk to those. We already did the puzzles in these, um places so his mazes yeah, we just have to talk to them okay there are four passwords that must be spoken to the sweetheart statue to unveil the secret tunnel actually as one of the chosen elite I have been given the responsibility of guarding the first of four it is a beautiful day out in the garden garden isn't it brothers and sisters ah you are saying you would like to know of the password I apologize. I'm afraid that I'm not. That is not in my jurisdiction. <laughs> no. I suppose something tasty, off white and cubish may change my mind. <laughs> Give Carol the illustrious a tofu. Yes. Here you go. Oh. Hmm. Delicious. Irresistible tofu. I suppose it could. Could let it slip just this once. Now, lean in closer. The password that I have been trusted with is sweet. You got that? I promise he won't tell anyone, okay? Sweet, okay. Interesting. Well, luckily, how many, how much, how many tofu do we have? How much tofu? Thirty. <laughs> oh god, damn it! All right, all right. This is the other one. Oh, there's a mushroom there. Do we act? Let me see if there's anything at the mushroom. It's a suspicious, suspicious-looking mushroom. Would you like to take a bite? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Oh god, where, where are we now? <laughs> you! <laughs> well, this is an interesting find. <laughs> J-Shroom. You, bulbous one. Your eyes, they tell me that, you're, that you yearn to learn. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. I will teach you. Come. <laughs> what the fuck? You have come. Excellent. Now observe, the hard bulbs like the one behind me hold creatures like me. However, we are unable to escape by our own means. With a very specific and intricate cunning technique, one would be able to release us from our buddy fate. However, this technique takes years, perhaps even decades to master. If you agree to learn it, there's no telling how long this will take. Yet with time, I, I believe you will do great things. Are you ready to take on the challenge become by my disciple? Yes, let's do it. Even if it takes <laughs> I'm already trained for a very for a long time. Excellent, 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 excellent. You have grown so much, unlike this bulb behind me. Now cut it using your perfected technique so that it, that it may live. At last I am free. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Take this, this is a gift from me. Oh, we've got a dandelion. Oh. Excellent, 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 excellent. 
Or we can jump on him. Got some jam packets. Very cool. <laughs> what the hell? Excellent, 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 excellent. So I'll just... I would assume there's going to be more of those in different parts of the world. Alex the Esteemed. There are four passwords that must be spoken to the Sweetheart Statue to unveil, its, unveil the secret tunnel. Actually, as one of the chosen elite, I have given the responsibility of guarding the third of the four. know the password. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Oh, you really need it? Like you really, really need it? Like you really, 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 really need it? Like you really, 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 really need it? Hmm. Hmm. I guess you have, I have no choice then. But you have to promise not to tell anyone else. Pinky swear on it? Yes. <laughs> and done. Poof, I was worried you might be some someone untrustworthy. Now, lean in closer. The password I have entrusted with is built. That's the third one. I guess this is the second one. Yep, that's the second one. I want to know the password, eh? Not so fast there, buddy. I gotta say, you're awfully tall for a sprout mall. How do you know... How do I know you really are one of us highly intelligent and majestic creatures? You think I ever spilled a password to a potential spy? Ha! <laughs> don't make me laugh. If you're so sure you're a sprout mole, why don't you prove it? I'll tell you the password. If you can guess what I am thinking about right now. Tofu. Oh. Mmm. Delicious tofu. I apologize for ever doubting you. I guess there are all kinds of sprout bowls out there. Now, leaning in closer, the password of trust this jelly. Sweet jelly. Sweet jelly. Uh, I forgot the third one already. Sweet. Sweet jelly. Filled. Sweet filled jelly. Don't tell me it's tofu. <laughs> there are four passwords. This is the fourth one. Or for the fourth. Uh, I'm, suppo I'm supposed to hold on to this super secret password and everything, right? But, like, it's about food, so I'm just so I'm just thinking about food all the time. It makes me so hungry that I've started chewing on the grass to curb my appetite. Can you believe it? They should really start providing food to the guards around here. And, like, what kind of password is Donut, anyway? As in, like, that stupid pet name that, that weird blue guy always called Sweetheart or something. Please, that's no secret at all. Anyone could guess that. They were always walking around here and ex acting like, acting all coupley, calling each other names like that back and forth, saying things like, "Why, do, why wouldn't, you, why won't you ask me to marry you yet?" And I'm sorry, my friends don't. I'm sorry, my friends don't approve of this relationship all the time. Ah, oh, so annoying. But whatever. I'm still stuck here guarding the passwords with all the, those three other guards. Those guys couldn't keep a secret to save their lives. Hmm, that's right. Pity me if you want. See if you are care. Here I am, trapped here in this lonely little corner of the garden, guarding the word donut of all things. Jeez Louise. Sweet filled jelly donut. Oh, I guess we have to fight this guy now. It's a natural one! Rebound time. Mm. 
We'll save our energy here. Beautiful. There we go. Swing back. Oh, the Marsha fell over. over to hero get multiple enemies at once without using too much of our um, juice there we go 1352 experience looks like we probably have to fight the horse here so oh it's a natural one again But there we go. I'm gonna trip it actually. That's sad. Oof, horse hit hits. It's all right there. Get out of here. 90 damage, that's good. Oh, she's angry now. Oh, that was a dull attack. Whoa. I'll just continue counter countering here. Let's rebound and then hero can... Let's heal. We'll breathe here. We can. Oh, we hit a Mori. We'll double hit there. It's past the hero. go. 1,215 experience. Cheese wheel. Some tofu as well. Might as well fight one more time so we can um, level up here and then we'll save. It's a natural one again? Holy hell. Swing back at her. Swing back at the enemies. Should be a big hit. 82, that's good. Oh, tried to cast the spell, didn't happen. I'll just heal Aubrey again. With hero. Lucius. Boom. Oh, she won't be able to counter here because it hit multiple enemies, it hit multiple people. Oh, didn't need to do that. <laughs> there we go, level 19. Painful truth. Ramori. Deals damage to a foe. Mori and the foe become sad. Okay, let's do that. that. Yeah, that's pretty much better than a sad poem. 
Because I'm able to do damage. Not only am I able to do damage to a foe, but I also make the foe sad and also Amori sad. So that can like that combos with stab as well. So quite good. So weird that I have a body pillow <laughs> and Aubrey's using it. Oh, I didn't even realize it had a, a new weapon. I think I would have gotten it in the um the what's it called? The castle. So this does yeah, that does that's got way more juice and attack on it. So that's yeah, let's put that. Luck goes down a little bit, but yeah, that's fine. I think hero. Oh yeah, it's got the teapot. But I think the frying pan is better, yeah. Yeah, Mori just has his knife. I think he's just going to have that knife for the whole game. I don't think there's going to be any way we're going to see him going to use anything else. Unless... Unless there's like some weird buster sword that he gets. <laughs> or some like ultimate weapon of mass destruction. I don't know. <laughs> right, we made a save there. We'll go over here. It's the password. Sweet. Jelly. Build. Donut. You said sweet jelly filled donut. Hmm. Fine. There we go. I think we should save again. Oh, Jesus. Uh, oh, wait. I need to go up here. Yeah, I might as well save again because that's likely going to be a fight. make sure to have a backup save just in case your game crashes or the Nintendo Switch crashes for some reason. Well there's the pearl. Number one. Some presents. Dear, dear sweetheart, I love you so much. Let us have kids and s spend the rest of our lives together. I like that very, very, very much. And open presents are littered across the floor. Oh, the, the thing's starting. Buckets of paint. What is that moving? Oh, it's a bear. Got some choices for sale, patron. Oh, good. We have a lot of money, so we'll probably have to buy some stuff here. Um. Let's buy some more mango smoothies. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. The rare bear. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that does some damage. That's good. Bring its defense down, there we go. Let's counter here. 
running gun with Kel and then cook Aubrey. Now. Oh, okay. I didn't realize I can actually do that. Continue buffing that. I would, I would assume that does more damage now. I want to go on a little bit crazy here with the a little bit ambitious. I think that does the same damage. Four. Big hit and that killed it. Round an experience only. Found a teddy bear, that's good. Handley's lost friend. Handley. Sweetheart, you are my queen. I love and appreciate everything that you you do more than anything. Please respond. I don't think she's responding. <laughs> Alright, um, we're gonna have to heal the juice. And we'll use a little one here, like the plum juice on um, a here. Okay. Oh, I should have just used... Oh, wow, that was... Fuck. I just used all those. Oh, there's a save point here. Oof, okay. we go. Wherever this leads. Oh, back here. We're back here. At the stage. Finally made our way out. Let's escape. Oh, what's all... What's with all these decorations? It looks like someone's about to get married. Uh oh, the show's about to start. Let's hide. Sweetheart getting married. Welcome all, welcome all. Today is, is a most momentous occasion. 42 seasons of Sweetheart's Queen for Hearts. It is now time to air our final episode. It has, has been a, a splendiferous run. Thank you. Thank you all for your view viewership. For as long as we have been on air, we have rigorously looked for a perfect sweeter for our beloved sweetheart. And each time, regretfully, sweetheart was unable to find her one true love. But this time, we believe that we have truly outdone ourselves. This is the moment to end all moments. History begins here. Dim the lights, please. The final episode begins now. Let us commence the wedding. Who is she marrying? Please welcome to the aisle. Sweetheart's perfect sweeter. Uh, 
Oh my goodness. Fucking cake. Unless someone's gonna pop out from it. Yes, it's true. Now you've seen everything. The answer has been obviously or has been obvious all along. The only sweets are magnificent enough for sweetheart. Is sweetheart as well. Oh fucking hell. Silence. Ahem. Let us begin the ceremony. Here we go. How does this work? <laughs> Dear, dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. <laughs> Kel's laughing. Sweetheart's marrying herself, that's so lame. Don't laugh, Kel. I actually feel kind of bad for her. Now, does anyone object to this holy matrimony? Speak now or forever hold your peace. In that case, by the power vested in me, I now pronounce you sweetheart and sweetheart. You may I now kiss the... I object! Stop the wedding immediately! Aubrey! Don't do this, sweetheart. This wedding, this wedding is a sham. Loving yourself is one thing, but this is taking it way too far. Not you again. How dare you step foot back in here. Guards? Guards? Sweetheart, you're making a mistake. You can't just marry yourself. There's someone out there for you. I know it. Oh, pretty. what are you doing? He's going to send us to the dungeon again. Huh. You understand nothing, random hero, hero fan. <laughs> I was a young princess once. I too once thought there was someone for me out there in the universe. But that all isn't, that's, that's all in the past now. I no longer believe in true love. I'll never lose anyone else ever again. The only person I'm going to love from now on is myself. Now guards, seize her! Uh, hero? I don't think this is a good idea. Sweetheart, listen to me. You don't have to do this. What's this? Could it be? Hero? My hero has come for me. Oh my sweet hero, I knew you wouldn't leave me alone like this. How you sway me with your words. Although it may be over between us, my heart has not yet forgotten you. I will give you one last chance. Marry me, hero. Here and now. Do so and I will let you... Let you and your friends... Let your fans live. Wait, what? I can't do that. That's crazy. this? You reject me? Again? But how could this be? I don't understand. <laughs> uh oh. Now you've done it. Ah, yes. I see everything clearly now. I'll admit, I'll admit it. I was wrong about you, hero. I thought you were a, were a worthy champ companion, but it seems you are jealous of me, just like everyone else. Yes, that must be it. My dazzling looks, my charming smile, my granarious personality. It must be so difficult for you to even stand in, in my presence. Well, there is no need to despair anymore. I will end your suffering, personally.
<laughs> Farewell, miserable peons. I'll lock you up in the dungeon forever. Oh my goodness, okay. Yeah, let's do all those moves first. Bring her attack down. Should have brought her defense down as well. Oh, we'll slap, we'll swing back though. Oh, hero, my hero. Your smile charms my heart. Oh, make it mine. Holy shit. Ooh, it's a multi-hit. Okay, that's not good. Stab. Right in the heart. I think that was literally at the heart. <laughs> We're almost at the full power already. Yeah, she's got a lot of health. I have to heal over here. Oh, she's happy now. It's probably better. juice there. There we go. Right in the heart. It's pointless, you fools. You cannot dampen my positive energy. Oh, she can no longer be sad or angry. Okay, that sucks. Oh, I missed Aubrey. Ooh, god damn. All our attack, okay. Counter, running gun. Um, I'm gonna use a I'm gonna use a mango smoothie here. Oh, hero. I'll heal more, so nice, big hit. Oh Jesus Christ. Release energy! <laughs> 480 damage. You dare raise your fists at me? Fools, you should be gro groveling on your knees. Oh, that's juice recovery. Oh, God. It's a shame that you won't be able to enjoy it for much longer. Oh, she's ecstatic now. Ah, oh, 
damn it. It's because I'm angry. I need to switch it so that I'm not angry. <laughs> Should've hit the snack time as well. It's fine though. Yeah, let's reduce his speed here. Oof, big hit there. Here. Yeah, getting the fries hit on Kel is a lot easier than Hero because Hero is obviously slower, so there's another big hit. Yeah. So you are still standing. Cockroaches are res resilient, I suppose. <laughs> She's become, she became maniac, manic. Oh God. She's gone really crazy. Might actually snack time here just in case something bad happens. Yep, Aubrey got hit there. Oh, Kel got hit too. Oh, Hero got hit. That's good. That was actually a good prediction. Headbutt. That's a lot of damage. Snack time, everyone. Everyone, I think. Oh boy, that was not a good idea. Oh, I'd miss. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, we had a normal attack there. That was attacking with Amori, that's okay. This will do a good amount of damage, anyways. Let's just attack again. There we go. Holy hell. Is this what they call defeat? I cannot accept this. I will not accept this. You are nothing but a bunch of lowly, lowly peasants. Five thousand eight hundred experience and got one thousand three hundred seventy-six clams. Level twenty. Got shun. Wind up throw. Megaphone. Activate. Oh, cool. Cool moves. How could this be? You... You're all nothing. How dare you defy me? Throw them in the dungeon. Guards! Guards? It's over, sweetheart. The wedding is cancelled. No. I cannot accept this. Just leave me alone. Captain Space Boy, my sweetheart, 
Oh, my sweetheart. Oh, I am so relieved that I made it in time. You must stop this madness at once. Captain Space Boy? You. You idiot. I thought I told you to never show your face in front of me again. Oh, sweetheart. My sweetheart. My sweet jelly filled donut. <laughs> Please look into your heart and give me another chance. I should not have kept you waiting all these all those days. You What are you doing? Sorry I didn't do this sooner. <gasps> Marry me, sweetheart. Right here on this very stage. Oh my. This is all so sudden. How? 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 How romantic. Sprout more, Mike. I order you to marry us immediately. Yes, at once, my liege. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today. Oh, forget the form formalities, Mike. True love cannot wait. Yes, my princess. Ahem. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you, sweetheart and space husband. <laughs> Jesus, you may now kiss the bride. Oh, they censored it. <laughs> oh, sweetheart, let us travel the universe together and leave all this behind. Yes, yes, my husband, I will go anywhere as long as it is with you. Let us take leave, my sweetheart. We have been apart for, for too long. Come, my ship awaits. Yes, of course, my dear. But first, there is one last thing I must do. Sprout my Sprout more, Sprout more, Mike. Hand me the button. At once, my queen. What the hell's the button gonna do? We won't need all this anymore. Oh, Jesus! I'm ready now, dear. At long last, we can be together. Come, my queen. Our chariot awaits. <laughs> oh, what a happy ending to this one. Captain Space Boy comes back. And a hurry, sweetheart. So much for a happy ending. I don't think that's going to end well after, at all. Yeah, I guess that was a complete waste of time. <laughs> the bond with your friends became stronger. Everyone's follow-up moves improved. Very good. Can we, can, can we see what's in the explosion? No. no. <laughs> that would be interesting. Oh god. Something's come back. Basil? What's the matter, Omori? Is there something wrong? It's a long way down. You want to jump? Oh, Basil's definitely down there. I love how there's. No, I think this is just an option, but I. All right, let's jump. Oh, we're all jumping down.
We're in the library. White Ergot Orchard. In the language of flowers, it symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Read an excerpt. Sure. One by one, they fall. They fell asleep on their on the car ride home. It was a long day at the beach after all, and everyone was exhausted. L. The, the Kel, because it's three letters. Kel was the first to nod off, then then the rest. Oh, maybe. Hmm. Sunset over the freeway. Someone's head accidentally dropped onto someone's shoulders. Suddenly, a sudden jolt wakes him, but he doesn't dare to open his eyes. He pretends to have to been asleep and steadies his breathing. He listens to the sound of the road, feels the soft sun resting on his skin, and a slight tinge of pain. He's nose from tomorrow's sunburn. He is happy very very happy and he makes a vow to himself that no matter what he will no matter what he will remember this moment forever mountains of books forgotten through time the keeper of this library has long since passed get out of here spiders jesus christ <laughs> All right. More books though that we can read. A puddle of juice stinks, sinks into the carpet. Hovering above it is none other than someone holding an orange juice. He looks around at his friends who are wearing the same face of disappointment. He lets out a guilty chuckle. In what seems like less than a second, someone disappears out the front door. A tiny black kitten makes her way through the stain, leaving sloppy yet wet trail, wet tracks all across the carpet. Hero's face turns around and yells for Kel, but Kel is already long gone. I don't know, maybe, I don't, I'm not too sure who... I would assume they're talking of... I would assume these books are about... Maury Kell and, like, the group. The general group here. I don't know who... Who is which. <laughs> who is which person. Someone's hands... Something... Someone hands something... Some wet paper towels. It looks like they're the only adults here. And if they don't clean up this soon, this up soon, the carpet is gone, going to stain. I will have to deal with Thing later. Something? Someone? <laughs> sure. Read another excerpt. It was a hot summer day and all... All someone could think about was why they couldn't do this tomorrow. The backyard was a mess. Planks of wood were strewn about the area. Paint stains blotched the grass thanks to someone and someone's work. All day someone watched someone <laughs> lug, <laughs> lug planks of wood back and forth from his dad's pickup truck. He watched someone hammer his fingers over and over again and made note that over an hour has passed since someone has climbed down the ladder. It was just... It will just be their moral support. Someone thought as he sat sleepily in the shade of his favourite tree. Of course he knew this would be the case. Soon his friends will be asking for his help and he won't be able to refuse. The tree house is for everyone so... It's only fair that everyone puts someone 
everyone puts some work into it. Someone knows this and agrees. It's reluct reluctantly, he slides up and wobbles his way to the mess. He knows he should put in his fair share. It just had to be on the hottest day of summer. I'm pretty sure during the story of like in the not dream area but the real world is like it's like summertime I think. Oh, that was Aubrey. This year, someone was lucky enough to get assigned to a desk next to a small window. Every day during class, someone would gaze listlessly through the opening. At the shadows of the trees, the clouds creeping overhead, his mind drifted elsewhere, into his own worlds, his own stories, his own adventures. He had a habit of doing this. It was easy for him to get, to get lost. Today was the same as every, any other day. I would assume this is a Mori. Maury stared vacantly out the small window as the clouds passed one by one. Suddenly a hard hand playfully slaps his hand back, snapping him out of his reverie. Someone looks away from the open. Kel smiles. He's mo <laughs> yeah, that's probably Kel. He motions that class is over and that it's finally time for lunch. It's pizza day today and they need to bolt to the cafeteria before it's all gone. Amori's, yeah, Amori's stomach growls. He looks at the small window one last time. He would have continued to, he would have to continue his adventure another day. Sunset, a strange statue watches over the hidden lake. It might have meant something significant in the past, but time has made it engraving illegible. It's engraving illegible. Either way, it doesn't matter to the company visiting it today. They're only here to use it as a diving board. <laughs> the brothers taking turns jumping off the statue. Hero jumps first, then Kel. Then Hero again, then Kel again. The brothers grace gleefully urge Omori to join them. And after some careful thought, Amori rarely agrees. Amori shuffles up the statue and looks down at the moving water. He can hear his heartbeat. His ears begin to ring. His legs fell as if they would give out at any time. He, he tries to focus on his breathing. He feels something crawling on his shoulder and his eyes fly open to meet with those a black spider. In an instant, Amori loses all sense and hurls himself into the lake. Water fills his nose, his excerpts, his limbs, but the water is stronger. He's too weak, too helpless. All that, he, all that, that is what he believes. Amori shuts his eyes and waits for the brothers to save him. Oh, I think this is going to let us learn to Get rid of our um we can swim. Remove our fear of swimming. Of of, of the water. Our fear of the water. Find a book of interest. Everyone is over again today. Special occasion is Sunday, Saturday morning. From 7 a.m. to 11 a.m., a group of six friends eat a delicious homemade breakfast and watch TV together. It's the most enjoyable part of every week. Mori looks at the clock. 8 a.m. Two hours left. He would be able to watch. He'll be able to watch with everyone else until 10 a.m. when his tutor arrives. Mori grimaces. What he thought would be ready would be a rewarding hobby has been nothing more than a nuisance. Instead of watching the shows with the rest of his friends, he'll be the only one to miss out. If only he could watch the last hour of everyone else. If only he didn't have to play the violin. Something opened. A 
was the door to the... Like a door there. Oh, is there another... Oh! L. The L key. Seven keys left. Part of the shelf has been cleared out. There is a hole in here. Into the hole. But the door opened. Ah, oh, Giving me a choice as to what to do here. So I'll go in here. Oh, let's eat some. Let's eat some. Feel better. Let's make a save here. Two days left. Oh, Jesus. Lost library. Wall heals, feels hollow here. Grand piano, the world the word Amori is etched across the center. Why does the wall feel hollow? Can't do anything, can I? into that hole. Seems like that's the only thing to do. Oh, Jesus. Don't forget, it's in the toy box. What's in the toy box? What? So you're thinking the light bulb on the computer. Okay, so L is a part of the thing. Oh, I need to find C. Black. So that third word, yeah, it's the third word is is black. I don't, I don't know what it fully says, but yeah, that's a bit weird. That's that's a weird one. Okay, um. those guys um the only thing we, we can do here again is the stab so let's just stab there was no door so two days left
Oh, we're back in the, the sunny. Someone's knocking on the bloody door. A new message. Hey, Sonny, it's Mommy. Are you doing okay? You haven't been answering my calls or responding to my voicemails. If you keep ignoring me, I'll start to get worried again. I hope you're, pace you're pacing your chores. I don't think I... I don't think even I could finish everything in one day. Did you end up visiting Kel? If not, it's alright. I understand. Just keep... Just take things at your own pace. By the way, can you check the closet downstairs to see if there's anything you want to keep? We'll probably just throw anything... Throw away whatever you don't want anymore. There's only two days left before I come pick you up. Okay, that's it for now. He loves you. Bye, honey. I love how we, we still don't want to do the chores. Hang on, whoever's knocking on the door. Save points in the in the room here. No more knocking. <laughs> the wardrobe. Dirty dishes. Who is it? What's Kel again? Hello? Hello? Sunny? Are you there? Let's open the door. Hi, Sunny. Top of the morning to you. <laughs> well, more than more like noon, actually. It turns out Hero is not coming back until dinner today, so I thought I'd drop by a little later. Mum is having me buy some stuff at Faraway Plaza before he comes back. And I thought it might be funnier if we went together. You want to come along, Sunny? Of course you do. Come on. Let's go. Hold on, Sonny. You can't go back home yet when there's still so much to do. Open up. It's a brand new day. The orange cat looks hungry. Feed it some fish. Had some fish on it. Off it goes. It's just bouncing. The cat left with left a gift for you. Oh, we've got some trash. We'll make some money back for that. Oh, we can't tag, tag in with Kel. Alright, we'll do a little bit more with this. And we'll end the session off once we reach the plaza. What the heck? What just happened? What happened here? Dang it. It must have been Aubrey and the scooter gang. Sunny, to be honest. Do I smell? Oh, I go to his house yet. No response for that. No response either. more trash around here. <gasps> There's Basil up there. I think this person's new here. Hey neighbor, how's it going? Hey Kel, 
Oh, and who else is... Who else is with you? Oh wait, I recognize you. It's Sunny, isn't it? Sorry, it's been a while. I think I've, we only met a few times. My family has always lived here. But I was sent off to boarding school for a few years and just came back about three years ago, I think. Hey, Sunny. Chris is my next door neighbor and she really... And she's really cool. She's the fastest swimmer in school. When she's in the water, people compare her to a mermaid. Or a shark. Or even a torpedo. Oh, Kel, you're never short on compliments. <laughs> Aren't you trying to... Trying out for the junior... Varsity basketball team this year? I'm sure you'll... You'll, you'll be a shoe-in. <laughs> oh, well, I'll try. I've been playing it ever... Every now and then with strangers at the park. I think I'm getting better, but it's a little hard to tell. But if I'm practice if I practice basketball as much as you practice swimming, I'll probably have a better chance. I'm not that hard working. It feels like fun to me, honestly. And besides, even though I love swimming in pools, I love swimming in the ocean even more. I love everything about the ocean. The beach, the sound of the waves, even the smell of seaweed. <sighs> Sorry, I must be- I must sound a little obsessed. That's totally fine. It's good to be passionate about something, isn't it? I guess. Actually, I think... This is all started because I went to boarding school on an island and really enjoyed my time there. The ocean reminds me of my friends I've made there. I hope maybe I can see them again one day. But, for the time being, I guess I'll just be collecting she seashells and stuff. You know, the kind of story reminds me of this, but Sonny is actually moving away from here really soon. Maybe you can give him some tips on how to how to handle moving away from to a new place. Oh, Sonny is moving? Hmm. Well, being away from my friends was pretty tough at first, but change is just a fact of life. It's the memories we make with them and that we should cherish. You know what? I just decided something. If you see any seashells, can you bring them to me? They're kind of hard to find around here, but I'll make sure it's worth it. Interesting. What a lovely day for a picnic. I brought my my specialties, chicken pot pie, lemon pie, and of course, my world famous apple pie. Oof, making patties is hard work, but once I sink my teeth into, the, into that tender juicy burger, it's all going to be worth it. Hmm almost taste it now. Here, pay attention. The patties are burning. Oh shoot. Thanks, hun. That was close. Alright, we'll make a save before we talk to Basil. Hey, Kel. Hey, Sonny. What's up, Basil? Nice to see you out and about. Are you feeling better after yesterday? Huh? Yesterday? What do you mean? You had a big stomach ache, didn't you? That's why you had to go to the bathroom? Oh, alright. Yeah, I feel much better now. Do you want to hang out with us today? Sonny's not going to be around for much longer, you know. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow? Sorry. Oh, don't worry, you don't have to force yourself. We can always catch up later. Yeah, you're right. Okay then. See you later, I guess. Oh. I was really sad about more um Sunny leaving. Look at all this trash I'm getting. Meanwhile. Let's talk to this guy here. Hey pals, good to see you. These new recyclist folks have been showing up and making a real big change around here. This is the first time I've seen so many people taking the initiative to pick up trash. Makes the job a whole lot easier, haha. <laughs> Something about them feels a little fishy though. Yeah, they look a bit weird. There we go, six dollars worth of trash. Beautiful. Make a save again. Let's 
go to the plaza. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have to stop at Gino's Pizza and then end then, then the bakery in Other Mart. Lead the way, Sonny. That's what I was saying. Can you believe in her? But then, hmm. That was like the time we. Yeah, and then honestly, I think that. Yes, definitely. Alright, let's. <laughs> Let's stop at the, um, the Gino's Pizza first. Oh, Aubrey's there. Gino's Pizza is the bomb. This is one disgusting, dirty, greasy looking cheesy pizza. Cheese pizza, just the way I like it. Let's dig in. So... Hmm. <laughs> munch, munch, munch. We still... We still on to go to our secret hangout spot today, right? I'm going to bring my fishing pole. Made it myself. Out of a cool stick and a jump rope yesterday. Do you think we'll, it will work, Charlie? Eh. So we're doing... So we're going to our secret hangout spot. That's the perfect date. That's a perfect date spot. Be sure to bring one of my special ladies. Swimming. Towns. Pretty fun. <laughs> Well, you're all fooling around being babies. I'm going to, I'm going, I'm going to be busy skipping rocks. <laughs> I've been looking for the perfect rocks all week. Eh. You can try all you want, Kim, but you'll never beat Aubrey's record. Shut up, Mikhail. Like all the girls would actually want to go to the lake with you without you paying them. I told you to call me the Maverick. Ah, I bit my tongue. <laughs> What a loser. <laughs> Master, you hurt? Yeah, I'll pish do for this, Kim. <laughs> Hello and welcome to Gino's Pizza. What can I get you? Hi, I'm here to pick up an order. I see. What would you like? Oh, I know. Would you like pizza? Nom nom. I think my mum phoned in an order for a hero sandwich this morning. I'm just here to pick it up. Oh, I see. You're the family that keeps ordering sandwiches instead of pizzas. But it's on the menu, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah. You're right. I guess so. Okay, I'll go get it. <laughs> you know, I don't know if, if I ever told you this, but that's why my brother's, brother's nickname is Hero. You think it's because of some really cool reason, like he saved a puppy when he was a kid or something, but no. <laughs> he just really likes sandwiches. Now here's your hero sandwich. Please enjoy. You got Kel's pizza order. Pizza order. Cool, thanks. Alright, we're good to go now, Sonny. Ready when you are. Now we just need to get the cookies from the bakery in the other part. Ah, my tongue. Sonny and Kel, what are you doing here? Don't you know it's rude to bother people while you're eating? Ew, it's a nerd. Grumble, grumble. Leave us alone. We've got no business with you today. Dancer's just munching away. Pizza. Hello. <laughs> Charlie. Alright, let's just get out. Probably need to buy more band-aids. So we might need to do a job. I don't know. Not sure. Let's go to the bakery. Mum placed an order there. It's up here, top right. Bakery's open. Fresh bread. Fresh bread. Would you like some fresh bread? Fresh bread, fresh bread. Would you like some fresh bread? I've been running this bakery for four generations ever since my mum sailed here for across the sea. I hope one day my children will be able to carry on the tradition of managing this bakery. It will mean the world to me and my husband. What is our fav family bakery? What would you like? I am here to pick up an order. 
Hmm. Ah, yes. Your mother said you'd be, you'd be coming, though. Though I expected you to be here a bit earlier. I'll go grab your order. Oh, we're a little bit late. Oh, that's okay. Did you know? The bakery belongs to Mikayo's family. I guess you can't really tell because he wears this horrible... <laughs> that horrible yellow wig all the time. Seems like he's making a pretty big effort to stand up and be different. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Here's your order, sir. Hope, hope, we hope to see you soon. Please enjoy your baked goods. Here's the bakery order. Oh, thanks. All right, we're good to go now, Sonny. Ready when you are. Yeah, let's go home. <laughs> let's let's go home. Let's buy some um some of these. Let's just buy some bandages. We have five of them. Oh, we have plenty of first aid kits, so I guess I'll just buy two more of two more bandages. I love how that like they're so cheap, and they actually heal you. With the candies, they don't actually heal like heal much, unlike the like the normal worlds, or like the green world. Baked goods, check. Sandwiches, check. Well, that's everything, and just in time too. It looks like the sun is about to set. Let's go back to my house. Hero should be coming there. Home at any time now. All right, I think we're gonna go ahead and um, save this. Basil's gone. Uh, let, yeah, let's go ahead and save the game here, and let's end the session off here too. Um, so, yeah, next session I reckon we'll be going ahead and ending those. Getting those orders, that order that we just got, and we go back to Kel's house, and we'll see Hero for the first time in the in the real world. So that'll be interesting. Oh wait, hang on a minute. Not an amusing beehive. Yes, let's disturb the beehive. <laughs> hang on a minute. Oh, we can't run from this. Boy, Kel's just taking all the damage. Oh boy, this was a bad idea. Well, we've got two of them. Encourage Sunny and Focus as well. Oh, they're flying around quickly. Encouragement. Why is this a fight? <laughs> I don't really need to do the focus encouragement. Probably help with another possible fight later on, but it's so weird. experience or anything like that. <laughs> it's just, just a fight against the beast. Why not? Alright, that's gonna be it for me. Uh, so, yeah, next session we'll just go back to uh, Kel's house, it seems, and then we'll be able to see Hero for the first time in as Sunny, and yeah, we'll see how we go from there. Uh, but anyways, thank you everyone so much for watching this. If you guys have enjoyed it, if you missed the previous episodes of Done for the Series, you can check it out via playlist on the right side of the screen. On the left side of the screen, a playlist of other games we're playing in the past or currently playing at the moment. And in the middle, you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on games such as this and any other games I'm playing at the moment. Uh, currently, I'm playing through um, Neon White. I'm actually almost finished with that game, so if you're interested in seeing the whole series, you can check it out on the channel and any other games I've played as well. So, anyways, that's going to be it for me. Thank you, everyone, so much for watching this. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys next time. Bye.